Give Angela a hand, ladies and gentlemen. Well done. All right. Now, what I want you to do is get relaxed. Lean back in the chair. Relax. Would you like some uh, ice cold water? Okay. Uh, relax. Uh, just try and be yourself. I realize it's a strange environment, but uh, I think it'll be productive for you. Tell me the last three songs that your your iPod randomly played for you. Uh, playlist or uh, Spotify or Pandora, whatever whatever you uh, use. Go to go to your uh, list of music and hit shuffle, and we'll just skip through the first three songs. What's the first one that comes up? All right. Old Mom, where do I go from here? Okay, press forward. Skip to the next song. Bangers, Wrecking Ball. That's Miley Cyrus. Yeah. And the third one? Medina, Addiction. So you've got Wrecking Ball, Addiction, and where do we go from here? It sounds to me like you've got some problems in your life. <laughs> You've got some issues that you're working through. Uh, you, you, you're currently employed, yes? Yes. But there's someone at, at work who uh, you do not get along with. Mm -hmm. Someone buddy heads with you, yes? A superior. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this is a, it's a woman. Sure. Yeah. And, uh, and there's also <laughs> a larger, portly, uh, dark-haired uh, uh, man who also has it out for you, yes? Maybe. Just yes or no? Not portly, no. No? Inside is fat. <laughs> See how people have self-images and they all oh, I'm fat and ugly. Uh, he has a horrible self-image, which is why he's so mean to you. Yeah. Yes. And his name is uh, I'm getting an S. Is it a Stan or a Steve? What's his name? Adam. Adam. Yes. Adam. <laughs> well, S. Who tempted Adam? Who tempted S? The fate. The serpent. The serpent. That's what I'm seeing. Oh, okay. And I'm seeing, yes. I'm seeing, this is not bullshit, ladies and gentlemen. I'm seeing pictures. Sometimes I have to dial in a little bit, Angela. Okay. All right, so, so, uh, uh, fat, skinny Adam is bugging you. And the woman's name, if it, there's an M in it, L. M and O P, somewhere in the middle. Of the I'm getting the middle. D. Yeah, the middle is what I was thinking. <laughs> the middle of the alphabet. Denise. Dawn. Dawn. So you have Adam, the beginning of mankind. Dawn, the beginning of the day. Yet all three of your songs portend horrible endings of the end of the world. Wrecking Ball. What were the other two titles? Addiction. The problem is you're being blocked at work by these two uh, troglodytes. Okay? Dawn. Dawn and Adam, who's fat on the inside, yet skinny. Is he handsome? Not eh, really, no, but he's not fat. Okay. The problem is, you are allowing yourself to be manipulated because of things that happened to you in a past life. I'm sensing uh, uh, you've had many, you're not a new soul. Do you ever feel like you've been here before and you've done things? Yes, you're, a, you're an older soul. You were a, 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 a monk, a friar in Ireland several lifetimes ago, and you weren't very nice. You were mean and, uh, and manipulative and, and in ways that only the Catholic Church can do. <laughs> and even though the Catholics do not believe in karma, this is your karma coming back to you. So the key is to release the old and uh, invest yourself in the vibration of this current lifetime so you may learn what there is to learn. Uh, and, and the way to do that is you must break, uh, you must break the cycle. Put your hands out like a T. Stand up, stand up straight, like a T. No, stand up straight. Like a T. <laughs> We're going to be helicopters. Helicopters, all right? I want you to. Uh, 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 and find a rhythm. Okay. Yeah. You? <laughs> Arms out, like a T. Uh, you have to make the noise. Uh. <laughs> Tomorrow morning, you have to go up to them 
and you have to tell them what I want you to do, and it's very important you do it exactly as I say, because as I discussed earlier, everything is vibration. So you must get into that vibrational cone. Other people call it an aura. I call it a vibrational cone. You've heard aura before. I want you to walk up first thing in the morning. I want you to walk up to uh, to dawn behind her like this and go, stop it. <laughs> Just like that. Stop it. Stop it. And she'll go, what? And you just go. <laughs> and what that will do, it will free, it, it will tell her that you are onto her, first of all. Secondly, it will, it will tell them that do not mess with this broad because she was a monk in a past life and she could kick your ass right now. Uh, you were also a monkey. You were a monk. Uh, and a long time ago, you were a, uh, a monkey. I wonder why she likes Bigfoot. Are you in tune with the Bigfoot? <laughs> See, this is what I'm telling you. I love that. Why is that? Because really? she was a monkey. I believe <laughs> Well, we have all, most except for this guy, we have all had <laughs> past, and I'm kidding, of course, you've had a past life. You just haven't enjoyed them. But that's okay. <laughs> we're going to get to you. This, this animal, uh, you know, human beings and chimps, 3% difference in the DNA. Very similar. So a monkey, you, 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 you need to get in touch with your animal vibe, your I animal, told, yeah. right? <laughs> Who told you this? Your boyfriend. <laughs> yeah. And he's right. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, what do you say when you walk up to dawn? <laughs> and then, the, then, then she turns to you and goes, Woo. Very quiet. <laughs> and then, later on, not in the same portion of the day. You must do this to dawn before noon. Okay. In the ante meridian, then in the post meridian, you walk up to Adam and you say, you're fat on the inside. <laughs> on top. You're fat. You don't have to uh, sound like me, but oh. feel, when I talk, put your hand on my stomach. On my stomach, yeah. You're fat on the inside. You feel how it's happening there? <laughs> this is the center, the, 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 again back to the chakras, the aura cone. The center of the body is where the navel is, right? And all the energy emanates out, goes to the genitalia for the love making, goes to the brain for the thinking. This is the middle ground. Between the heart and the belly, it's the middle ground. So this is where your power, animal instinct is. So when you walk up to Adam and you say, you need memory pills, I think. <laughs> you need the memory pills, I think. I think you need to do more animal things. I think what this therapy that I'm giving you for tomorrow with uh, Angela and Fat Skinny Adam is going to open, it's like a hose. You know how you, you turn the hose and it dribbles out at first, but then the more you and it's blowing, and you'll feel good because when it's cramped up like that, you're all you're tense and you're full. You want to open the the hose of your the floodgates. I'm getting another you were Noah's nephew on the ark. You were Noah's nephew on the ark, and that is why you love the animals so much. That is why you feel confined by the animals, and that is why you must release the animals. I'm done with you. Sit down. Get out of my hand. You were Noah's